Hey everybody, Mike here from Extra Life Gaming Lounge, bringing you another Play That Extra Life video. So this is the series where we look at games that are available to play at Extra Life Gaming Lounge. What we tend to do is a video highlighting a particular game. So rather than it being multiple games in one video, we choose one game and we give a look at that to do a bit of a, a playthrough of it so you get an idea of what the type of game is if you've not played it before. Or if you have played it before, let you know that it's available at Extra Life. The reason we do this is because we've got so many games available at the CAF that we can't really have a full list that covers everything. Plus, a lot of the games are changing. We put new games in as often as we can. Uh, so we figure just highlighting some of the games that are available will give you a bit more information on what type of things you can play when you come and visit Extra Life and today we are showing if you haven't already guessed is the nintendo 64 version of goldeneye i believe this was released in 1997 uh it was a brilliant first person shooter for the time had an awesome multiplayer mode on there four player was brilliant spent many hours playing this at a friend's house they didn't have an n64 at the time now we are not playing this on the n64 we are playing this on the xbox series x which is what it's also available on at the calf uh, we do bring in n64s on special requests and members nights but we don't have one there every day of the week but we do have the series x there uh, as like a, an everyday thing a set console and this is available on there so let's start having a go on GoldenEye, uh, the N64 GoldenEye, on the Xbox Series X. Uh, like I said, I believe this was released in 1997 on the N64. Haven't played this in years. I imagine it's not aged too well. We've been an early 3D shooter, but at the time this was awesome. Skipped many a German lesson to go and play this. Uh, which probably explains why I can't speak German. So yes, it's in, uh, GoldenEye's fault. Me and two of my friends, we would just play the multiplayer on this constantly. Uh, and which I would repeatedly lose at. But, at least we have the advantage of the controller on the Xbox Series X. It's much better than the terrible, terrible N64 controller. I don't care what anyone says. That controller was horrible. Never liked it. Picked up the KF7 Soviet, so I don't change weapons. Why? Yes, why? Cool. This was such a cool game back in the day, and it's really cool that this has uh, been released again uh, on the Series X. Weirdly enough, this seems to be one of the games that emulators or N64 emulator seem to have a problem playing for some reason. I'm not quite sure know why. Uh, but certain N64 emulators, or quite a lot of them, have a real problem playing this game. But we'll play other N64 games. Can I slap the glass? No. Got the sniper rifle. Look. Uh, yes. But yeah. Uh, like I said, I spent many hours playing this game. Really enjoyed it. Back in the day. And haven't really looked at it since. Although I do have an N64. Where's that dude gone? How did he get up there? Stupid guy. Oh, yeah, down here. You. <laughs> Which way is he going to go? Is he going to go down the stairs? I'm going to slap him. Well, I'm going to hit him with the butt of the gun, actually. There we go. Ah, yes. Remember this plane is uh, Pierce Brosnan's James Bond. Who, to be fair, is one of my favourite James Bonds. Although I didn't particularly like him in GoldenEye. Uh, but as time went on, he did become my favourite. I'm not saying they were all great films, but he was my favourite James Bond. I don't know whether that's just nostalgia reasons or what. Probably it. Many people out there which disagree with me, which is fine. Everyone's allowed their own favourite Bond. So 
So yeah, X is reload, as it should be. Right, the the old health meter, which was obviously the the watch front. See ya. To be fair, not as bad as I figured it would be playing this after however many years. I mean, obviously, it's a bit clunky and <laughs> not the most refined of shooters, but up until this point, I think shooters on consoles were pretty terrible in general, to be honest. To hit the do the thing, yeah, hit that. Let the truck through. Can I get in the truck? Can I even jump? I can crouch, change weapon. I look like I can jump. That changes weapon as well. Okay. So we're not doing any uh, solid snakes and hiding in the back of trucks. There's a bit of a pointless gate. Come on, let me through. Busy. Boom. <laughs> Don't you touch that alarm. Don't do it. Anyone in there? Are they just, just like, going to ignore me? Yeah, that dude, he was running for the alarm. I remember that bit at least. Very cool music as well, which uh, I'm sure will get flagged. The copyright or whatever. But there we are. Which way did I come in? That way. Okay, this way. So what was your guys' uh, favourite favorite James Bond film, if you're into it? I'm not going to hit the alarm silly thing to do. Can I open the door? Yeah. Cheeky. See ya. Can I open this door? Is this open anything? No. Did any of you guys play this uh, first time around on the N64, or have you tried it on the Series X since? I don't think that. Satellite communication link destroyed. Data cannot be intercepted by. Oops, I wasn't meant to do that. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, I think there's like multiple objectives actually. Let's have a look. Uh, controllers, music. Neutralize all enemies incomplete. Bungee jump from the platform. Incomplete. Background. Yes, yeah, so I probably wasn't meant to blow that thing up. Alright. How do we get out of this? Yeah. Oh. Alright. How do I exit? There we go. Open the gate. The, the four player on this was really cool multiplayer. Uh, although the Golden Gun was always banned. Hated the Golden Gun games. And you couldn't play his odd job. His odd job was cheating. He was too small. Just too small. No! Oh. I'm doing a bit of a commander role as I was walking up the ladders. I've got a sniper rifle, Anna. Can I see anyone? Is that. Oh no, there we go. I don't see, was that the uh, maximum range of the scope? But it wasn't. I don't think the sniper rifle's like good to be fair. No, nope, it sucks. Dude's got some serious strong knees, that didn't even arm him. Bye bye. Anything down here I can blow up. Cause damage with. No. Okay. Yeah, not the best sniper rifle in the world, is it? Let's be honest. Get down. Whoa! Might be why I can't get down the ladder. 
Yeah. That too. Yeah. Like the uh, exploding crits for one, but the photorealistic faces as well for the time. Char! Uh oh. That's better. So you do your sidestep right into me. There's a good chap. Keeping up the uh, stereotype of stupid James Bond villain goons. Hiding behind the corner. JK. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Keep running ammo. See ya. Uh, is anyone down here that I missed? Oh, the music's just playing away. Yes. Whoa. Ow. Dude's a sponge. Ooh. I suppose anyone's got any health lying around over there. Barrels labelled with Poison. Oh, what's down here? Anything nice? No? Okay. What about up here? There's an alarm. I'm not going to hit that. Let's have a look at the objectives. Is everyone dead? Incomplete. No. I haven't neutralized everyone yet. I'm going to go back down here because I kind of feel it's probably safer doing this underground than overground. Red lights. Who's not a good sign? To be absolutely nothing here. Exploding barrels. Poison labels on them. How about up here? Anything good? So I haven't. Is that a dude down there? No. Where is everyone then? I'm on the dam and this is where I'm meant to jump. What's that? Body armor. Yes, please. Give me the body armor. What's the look? Turn it up. I don't know. I assumed I needed body armor. But I guess. There we go. Did I miss anyone around here? Let's have a look. No one there. Let's go all the long way around this way then, I guess. Check down one corridor. We'll check all the way to the end of the other side. 
and hope I'm not going the wrong way. Hmm. I'll go back up to that in a minute. It's a big, I bet it's just like one dude. Promising. Hey, might be more than one dude. Holy moly, that's a lot of dudes. Set, all oh, line up. Come on. Uh. Die. Uh, tap on the computers. I blow up the service. <laughs> Main computer system damaged. Operational data loss. <laughs> I probably wasn't meant to do that. But. Now, James Bond, if you haven't left a loader. A load of explosions. Is that everyone gone? No, apparently not. I mean, so say there. Black hole. Don't know. But anyway, so yeah, this was back when uh, Rare was at their their height of developing really really cool games. Although they're back there now, I think. You know, it's uh. A really cool studio, right? I got to admit. Uh, I don't think they've done many bad games, if any. But this really put them on the map. I feel, anyway. I'm just going to try and bungee jump and see if I can do it. Whee! Am I going to. Is that going to end it? Or am I just dead? Mission failed. Oh, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever. Am I going to do it from the beginning again? Wow, well, we won't be doing that again. Uh, well, that, uh, I think that will call it at the end of that one because I'm not playing through that level again. It's not going to be very entertaining to watch it, let's be honest. But that was um, James Bond Goldeneye on the N well, the N64 version of James Bond Goldeneye playing on the Xbox Series X. I want to thank you all for watching this. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to like and subscribe. Uh, please let us know your experience with playing Goldeneye. And please feel free to come down and visit us at Extra Life Gaming Lounge in Sheffield City Centre. Uh, you can find information on our website, extralifegamerlounge.com. Uh, and you can also find us on Google, TripAdvisor, all those good places. Facebook, Twitter, you name it, Extra Life Gaming Lounge Sheffield. Uh, feel free to check us out and feel free to come down, play some video games, have some home-cooked food, homemade milkshakes, ice cream milkshakes, and all proper shakes, cakes, all sorts. Thank you all for watching and we'll catch you in the next episode. Goodbye.